Hello MechWarriors, how is it going? And welcome to your daily dose of MechWarrior Online. Today guys, we are playing the King Crab, the good old 100 ton assault mech from the Inner Sphere. And we are playing the triple zero because I wanted to play some Ultra Auto Cannon 2s. And guess what? This thing has six ballistic hardpoints and we're gonna utilize all of them today. So let's dive into the build before I discuss, you know, the benefits and of course the drawbacks of the build here. We have uh, three Ultra Auto Cannon 2s in each arm, which is uh, quite nice because we have that up and down movement so we can actually aim up and down quite nicely problem is we don't have any lower arm actuators which means we don't have the free movement horizontally and that means we have to kind of twist our torso when we want to uh, aim horizontally which makes it rather slow in terms of our aim reaction also there's another big thing i'm talking about the negatives too much but Bear with me, guys. This thing is fun. Um, there's another big thing when you take a look at the King Crab. Obviously, it's a big target. It's very wide. It has a massive center torso. So don't try to really tank with the mech intentionally because uh, you will be caught in no time. However, we also have um, our main weapons very far apart from each other. So peeking around the corner only brings one arm into the fight. And then that's only three Ultra Auto Cannon 2s, which is not that much. However, if you are in an open field brawl, if you're in an open field fight you can deal a whooping 12 damage alpha strike over and over and over and over and over again so you're basically just shredding the enemies with your crazy rate of fire and uh, i'm having a lot of fun just just going nuts with that shaking enemies cockpit driving them back uh, kind of forcing them back to cover suppressing them and of course dealing a good chunk of damage so that is the benefit of the build we have some skills, so let's talk about them before we dive into the two games that I want to present you today. And as you can see, we got the magazine capacity 1 and 2, we got the UAC jam duration, although I gotta say the Ultra Auto Cannon 2s are not really uh, that long in terms of their jam duration. However, when you just think about raw numbers, we have 6 Auto Cannons and we have a jam duration reduction of 15% and these Auto Cannons fire so fast that you will just jam eventually. And that means basically um, it's not really a, a DP... Is it? Actually, it's a DPS increase of 15%. That's just it. That's all I'm saying. I mean, no, no, not really a DPS increase. Only if they jam, they will come back online a bit quicker. But you get the point. You just get overall, if you have more weapons that benefit from it, you have a good benefit from it. Anyway, um, I always also said that uh, the mech was pretty hot earlier, and uh, I stick to that. So therefore, you really have to try to get some heat gen with the skills here. And I was trying to kind of max it out going down the right side, getting this arm here, the heat gens down here, and also the left arm, getting four in this little clip cluster and um, that's that's really really helpful because six auto cannon twos with only 14 heat sinks that's a lot guys that is a lot we also have the left side of the survivability tree because our king crab has some armor quirks and we're gonna amplify them even more with the um what is that uh, with the armor skills here and then of course getting maximum heat containment maximum cool run for the reason that i just told you we got a 60 percent rated approbation as per usual and then the double cool shots for additional heat management on top of a uav and that's it everybody i wish you a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now and if you have that then don't forget to leave a rating subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and now it's time to hit the battlefield all right first game of the day we are playing the solaris city we are playing assault and that is not the best map for our build here we really want to make sure that we can engage early and we can engage often using our 770 meters range so that we are not really getting shot back by the full force of our enemies in return um yeah problem is uh, this is a very structured and close range map which means we will most likely run around the corner and then everybody's there which means we are a big obvious target really having some trouble oh i cannot get around there whoopsie um uh, really having some trouble um you know defending ourselves that's what i want to say okay that being said let's go to the left side of this whole situation here let's not rotate let's not do a nazca let's rather do a counter nazca and we will meet up with the friends in echo 4 hoping <laughs> <laughs> all right that's funny oh, yeah, they're all in the that is uh, that's very funny uh hoping that the enemies are kind of taking the bait going to the right yeah, side their right side our left side and uh, coming in trickling in one by one so we can kill them fast that's the idea of a counter nesca so it seems like they're actually getting there question is um how can we engage here seems like the high ground is kind of busy kind of taken already now what what can we do down here i cannot really I can see we cannot really shoot through the gaps here we need an open field fight. This is far from uh, being one. Right. Hello, mister. Yeah, that's bad. Oh, God, that's so bad. So, I think I'm going to drop here. 
Whee! Let's go. And here we go. We have something in our sights. Let's go ahead and shoot everything that we can shoot. Hello, Mr. Mr. Fafnir. I wish I had some friends around. We're also quite hot already. Okay. Yeah, that's good. That's really good. Good. Good, good, good. Mad Cat is almost down. Foxtrot. I'm gonna go to the left side here. Let's go left side. Echo 3. I bring the King Crab. I could need some help, though. Oh, Uziel. Oh, he regrets his life decisions now. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Let's try to actually kill that guy. If we can get him, it would be so good. But we are hard again, and... We don't have the follow-up from the team. Oh, no. I hope that they were kind of also pushing with me, but they didn't. And, uh, yes, I was overextending big time. But we didn't get the kill on the UZL, sadly. All right. Cool. Uh, anyway, pe people are here now. So that means we, we are going in once more. Hello, everybody. Like, everybody. Oh, that's, like, absolutely everybody. I'm gonna get out of here again. Yup. Not a fan of that. Okay, so uh, we are getting overwhelmed left side. Echo 3. Uh, let's go right side. <laughs> let's go right side. This is not gonna work. I mean, I'm taking a lot of damage. And we got the Mad Cat down, basically. Um, but, oh, okay. They're pushing in. All right. Uh, turning around. All right. I'm gonna try to hold this here for as long as possible. What about my weapons? All of them jammed at once. All right. Hey, get some Daka Dervish. Get some Daka. But again, we gotta pull back while we are kind of trying to defend ourselves in this direction. Okay, so, ah, uh, Heavy Gauss coming from the right side. The Fafnir is still there. I'm also narked, which is bad. But you know what? That Fafnir? I'm gonna kill it now. Get the Fafnir Hotel. It's almost down. And we almost got him. Uh, down he goes. Okay, so we actually got the kill on that guy. That was very important. All right, so defensive line. We are kind of in the back of all, all of this here. Uh, cannot really get an angle, which is a problem. Um, but anyway, if they still want to peek this, we are here to hold this. Seems like they are making a push towards the right side now, so we're gonna go with them. My friends, that is. So I'm gonna bring my King Crab to the right side, Echo 3. I'm gonna make a push, but wait for me. I can take some damage, and I'm ready now. Let's go. That was uh, surprising. I'm pushing in now, right side. Let's get the Hunchback, and that's... Oh god, that's everybody once more. So we, we are dead, basically. Are we now? Are we? <laughs> they were waiting for it. But we still have firepower. We still have 300 shots. And I think I want to use them. So I have no armor anymore. I mean, my center torso is kind of broken. Oh, 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 oh. Another one. Are they making their desperate push to the front line now? Is that it? All right. We're going to change target here. Trying to get the Mad Dog. Side torso down. Side torso is on the Mad Dog, please. If you can. Oh, God. Are they running from us? Or are they still here fighting us? I don't know. Gotta try to take that thing out before it takes me out. And we got him. All right, so peeking around. <laughs> 10 and 8. We're still alive and we shouldn't be. We should not be alive anymore. That is so insane. So, uh, center torso doesn't look great anymore, but uh, we only have two enemies on the board. And um, they are getting actually some kills here. All right, quick draw. Quick draw is the scary one. We're gonna try to go for the other guy because he's easier to kill, though. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, here we go. Is he gonna kill me? Ah, uh, let's get him down. Couldn't get him. Uh, Phoenix Hawk is one shot. Um, we don't 900 damage though. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Let's take a look at what's going on here. Oh boy, what do we have? LRM5 and a tag on the Fox. Ooh, this doesn't look good, honestly. It might be that we are losing this game. Seems that we have a very overheated Hellbringer, which is going to blow up now. No, he came back to nominal uh, heat here. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. You you better you better have a good aim, buddy. Man, this is such a close game, and I love it. Yeah, that's the problem, though. The IV-4 is so strong. It's such a strong mech. Oh, no. Oh, no. Now the 4. Get him. Get the IV. Oh. Such a strong mech. Even if he is already damaged, he still has so much firepower. But that was such a close one. I really loved every single second about it. It was really cool to see, really cool to play. I really liked the shifting back and forth. And I really liked that people were actually responding to the calls. Super good, guys. We did not win it, but it was super close anyway. We got four killing blows, six assists. We got three solos. No, two solos. Three kill most damage dealt. 950 damage done. 680 taken with 11 components destroyed. And that was the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right. The second game of the day. We are playing Termaline Desert. We are playing Assault. And we have the... 
Uh, not a really good side here. Um, I'm not really happy with... Why am I in Alpha Lands again? Oh, God. But we have also an Evan Jaguar, as well as a Cyclops, as well as an Urban Mech with us. So that's kind of awkward. Uh, we are playing, or we are starting in the open terrain, which is, you know, okay. It's not, not great, but it's also okay. So that, you know, means we can shoot in, uh, in return here. So, and that's what I'm going to try to get. We yeah, have the Cyclops. I'm going to try to push down a little bit. Hey, guys. Oh boy, that's everybody. That's literally everybody. So we're gonna try to try to not get hit too hard. Try to dive down and break line of sight. Ooh, that was not great. I didn't think that everybody would be there so quickly. We're gonna watch this because there was a light mech there for a second. And I wanted to say he's probably gonna pop up again. He dropped artillery on me, so yeah, not great. But I might be able to dodge it mostly. I actually did. So... Here we are, our Cyclops is pushing forward, and it, it seems like we are kind of aggressing here. What is he running there? The Slaytony? He was also shooting some long-range stuff. I'm not really happy that I lost 10% of my armor already, but I think, I guess, it is what it is. So we gotta deal with that now. We're gonna definitely support the Cyclops, because he really wants to go somewhere, and uh, he cannot really go anywhere without support. Oh boy, I'm attracting fire like crazy, right? Go for the Marauder, because we already got some damage on him. My left side is wrecked. As, uh, I maybe should have not shot that guy. Oh, I attracted too much fire. Should have waited for them to get attracted by somebody else. And now we have to run through the explosions. Helping our friend, the Cyclops. It's kind of, I'm kind of bound to, you know, him now. He's also running some smaller weapons. Okay, we got that guy. That's good. And now we're on the backs of the other dudes. Okay. Hey, Blackjack. What about that? I'm now in a good position for me. That That is where I want to be. A little bit behind my firing line, but still on the front line so I can I can shoot. You know, uh, in the fight. Not really on the front line, but in the fight. So I can absorb a bit of damage. I can attract a bit of fire, but not all of it at the same time. This is where I want to be. So, Gauss coming from there? Or what is it? I don't know. What I do know is that we need to help out the friends here on the left side. And that is by collapsing the flank here. Sure. Let's go. We still have a bunch of people who are trying to push the guy in Echo 7. I hope they can deal with it without a problem. And without me needing to help out. Also, I want him to not shoot me in the butt. And I want to help those guys here. Which actually got out of the biggest trouble. That's great. Or did they? It's really hard to tell. I mean, I could go counter Nesca, but those guys are falling already. If I went left side, I'd die like them right now. So that's not good. We gotta stick to the team. We gotta stick to our friends here and hope hey, for the best. Uh, what? Shoot on UAVs? There are no UAVs right now. I don't see any. Oh man, problem is we have a NASCAR going on. Um, is it safe to push into the... Oh, that's what you mean with UAV. Yeah, that thing has to go. They know that we are coming. We should just turn around back for an echo six. Okay, copy that. Let's turn like, around then. Up. Yeah, I'm turning around. I bring the king crab, but stay with me, please. Cool. So, here we go. Tag it and like it. What's that guy? I shouldn't really waste my heat on this dude. Please don't shoot me. Oh, he's ATMs. Okay. Got it. Legs, 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 legs. Wow, he's faster than I think he is. Okay. Override engaged? <laughs> Alright. Problem is, we're getting horribly shot by people who are on the left side here. And I think I think this is it. Yeah, this is an 8 and something scenario. I am uh, going to push in. Let me try to get the Banatos. Hello! How are you, buddy? You should be so damaged already. But I'm gonna die, right? I mean, we got that guy. Still going. Still doing things. And now he finally got me. <laughs> well then, we got... Uh, wow, we got 800 damage done with this here. We got uh, 800 damage taken with a two killing a blows. I think the split wasn't the best idea in general here from our team. Come on, get him. He's one shot. <laughs> At the very least, take the Marauder with you. Yeah, there we go. Um, but yeah, again, it, it, was, it was kind of an awkward situation. Um, enemies, enemies got... got a very quick wrap around our flank there and they killed a bunch of people and then you know we had that one assault mech in the echo what was it, seven area that wouldn't die quick enough and therefore we couldn't really support we couldn't really help out it was really hard to kind of find team cohesion but in the end 
the mech performed and we dealt a good chunk of damage. We still have a Vapor Eagle on the board, so let's see. Maybe he can even get a kill out of this here. Uh, not like this year, because he's getting shot in the back so much. And that's a heavy PPC Blackjack. Interesting. I should probably play something like that. That guy has a bunch of PPC quirks, if I remember correctly. And uh, having two heavy PPCs is 30 solid pinpoint damage. Why the hell not? So, uh, GG everybody. Sadly, we lost this round, but anyway, I think you can really see the benefits of this build here. It can shoot early, it can shoot at long range, it has a crazy amount of duck eye, it runs hot as hell, but it's a lot of fun to play. We got two killing blows, we got two assists, we got one solo with two kill most damage dealt, about 800 done, again about 800 taken, with five components destroyed. And that, my friends, was your daily dose for today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can also support me on Patreon, link is down below in the description and i hope to see you on the battlefield goodbye